Hi guys, I'm Anna and today we're going to go through a 50-50 workout, which means half cardio and half toning. You might want a dumbbell of some description, you're going to pop out the way for now. You can use a tin of beans or you don't even need to use anything, whatever works. First up, we're going to warm up, so we need to make sure you're feeling fit and healthy, you've got space to move around in and you're feeling good today. Take everything at your own pace. Don't stress, we're not going too mad. So if you can jog, well, we're gonna jog here, but you might be more comfortable with an aggressive march. There's nothing quite like an aggressive march. You know the people that walk down the high street like this. We're all about that life. Jog in here if you can. What we're doing here is just trying to pick up our pulse rate and build some heat in our body. And so it's important that we work out at our own pace. Okay, let's take a new move. We step, knee, and march. So, step, lift. So you're stretching out a bit of bum. Step, lift. Now, if you can, we're gonna open up through the hip. So, sweeping it out. Yes, just in your own range. Again, I don't know what happened there. I'm on the wrong leg, never mind. Let's do four more because I'm having one of those days, again. If you can, we'll jog. Other side. Okay, let's go back to our full jog. So we'll stay here, just a little bit, or giving it that pumpy march that we love. Whatever you do is up to you. Right, we're tapping it to the side, we're gonna reach across and punch. So bring that arm, waking up our upper body. A bit bigger if you're fancy. And even bigger if you like, raise that pulse. Yes gang, four more, then three. And I'll tell you what, we'll go back to the beginning. So that jog, Let's put all of those three moves together. Jog in here for now. Then we're going to move into our hip opener. In three, two, one, and step, open, jog if you like. Step, and again, so just easing through your clunky hips. Let's do four more for me. So step, open, Yes. Last one. Now we're tapping it to the side. Move number three. Using whatever energy you feel is right. Whatever we're doing, we're being a little aggressive though. Because we want to get hot and sweaty. Again, one more lot of these. Yes, gang, four more here. Then we're gonna do another new combo, starting with the jog for now. Four, three, two, one, curl. Yes, four, three, two, one, heel to the glutes. So you can march. If you want to, we're gonna sprint and shake it. Step curl. Yes, shake it. So we're going to bring all the blood up the back of your butt. Last one. Let's go from the top, straight up jog or march. Last cycle. So after this, we should be feeling pretty warm and ready for action. Let's step and open up our hip. Jog if you like, in between, it's your call. Hey. Let's do one more. And a side tap. Punch it out. Keep it up. And move number four. Football sprint leg curl. Curl. So loads of blood flowing up there. Shake your bum at whoever you live with. Let's jog. 
So now we're feeling sweaty. Our arms, our shoulders, our back, our legs, our feet, our calves are ready for action. Step and open. And again, go up. Keep it going for me. Last one. Half jack. Take it across. If you feel good about life, you're going to reach the arm up now. Stretch through the side of the body. We're staying here for one more phrase to make sure that we're warm and pumped. Okay, the last one was our sprint and curl. Shake and curl. So you don't forget you can march. So much booty shaking. Four more. Again. Woo! Well done, hold and march. Okay, I think you're warm, I'm definitely warm. So we're gonna start, we have five exercises. Five, five exercises. We're gonna do them twice through. So, we'll do them for a chunk of time, then you get a little rest and you move on to move two. They're not complicated, I promise, and they'll come in levels. But we'll keep our feet moving as much as we can. Your first one is a high knee. So we're gonna lift it. So, bringing it up. So this will be a layer one, reach, reach. Okay, if you feel good, you're gonna drive it up. It's your decision. If you're here, you can pick up the pace too. Well done, gang, keep it going. Choosing your own level, nearly there. Last few seconds. And march. Ah, have a little break. Summon the power. Before we go into move number two, which is two half jacks, two full jacks, or just all halves. Up to you. So from the warm up, up, and then two hands. So you're gonna choose reach and then your higher level if you want here so up and two punch to the ceiling good choose it so you don't have to jump if you don't want to let's keep it going as sweaty as you can as we land we make sure our toes look a little bit out and the knee too. You're nearly there, keep going. Reach. Oh. Yes, team, two more. It's the last one. And hold it there. So anything, just to give you a little breather, coming in for move number three. Step it here. Okay. Take this bit at your own pace. So we step forward, back, and then jog. Other side. Forward, back, and jog. Let's do it again. Forward, back, and jog. Again. So we screw that front knee in so that it opens up. Watch the change. And then if you want, you can track her. Forward, back. Good, and yes. Let's go. And forward. Let's screw those feet in every time. Nice big arms and forward, back, hold, 
Let's do it again. Hey. Two more for me. Oh, I did legs earlier. What was I thinking? And, oh, this is the last one. Hold it there and march. Okay, we've got two more moves. Then we're gonna repeat these bad boys. The first, this one, we're gonna turn our body to the side, anchor a little bit on our front leg, that back, back forward. So this front leg is stillish. We're loading it the whole time. We're pumping the arms. Keep it low, keep it driving. If we want to, we can lift the knee. Stay the side. Four seconds. We're changing sides. Four, three, two, one, and step. So, we can keep it low. Apparently I'm drunk and in charge of a lunch. We can keep it low or we can drive. We get to choose. Whatever happens, we're staying a little bit on this leg, nice and bent. Keep it going. And four, three, two, hold it there and jog. Okay, our last move is simple but sweaty. So I want you to step over something, as big as you can. Okay, a little bit faster. In a sec, just get that movement over. It's gonna be a log jump. So you can stay with this level, you can keep it a little bit lower. Okay, let's go. Over. Yes gang, drive it up. One more set. Four, three, two, and one. Hold. Okay. We get a little bit of a longer rest this time. We're doing those five moves all over again. So fill your lungs with air and keep them moving, these legs, not your lungs. Definitely keep those moving. Keep the legs moving. It's your last round of cardio. Then we're gonna grab our friend. We've got a few minutes first. First one we did was high knees. We're gonna take it up. Choose your own level. You might be here, you might pick up the speed. You might charge it up. Choose, but let's pump it up. We're gonna do two phrases of music. Charge it up, pull. Push your breath out, gang. You can do it. Who's on fire? About eight seconds. It's the final frontier. And march. Hey. Okay, it's the jack bit. Two halves, two fours, if you can. Tap to the side, so reach. Two hands, good. This is level one. Hey, level two. Two legs, two hands. Let's do it again. Love team! I want to see you work! Reach! Sweat for me at home. Two more right here. Well done, hold! Woo! Big deep breath. Third set. We're doing this forward and back lunge. So it's one lunge, one forward and back, and then eight jogs or track as they close your feet together. So we go forward, back, and then jog or march. 
forward, back, and march. Okay, so our option was to add load, lower, lower, and then tracker. Let's go, forward, and tracker. Soft knees. Yes! So keep going for me. When we step to lunge, we screw our foot in. Yes. Let's do it four more times. Oh. And again. Forward, back, and. Keep going, I want two more. I'm going to show you something. As you step back, pick your back heel up. And the same when you come forward, pick the other heel up. Last one. Woo! And hold it there. We've got that knee drive this time. So we take it to face the wall. It doesn't have to be in time of the music. So you do you. Anchor this leg in. Dab it back. Pump. So, arms are on. You can add the drive if you want to. So you might be able to pick up the pace. Keep going, keep going. Four seconds. Change leg. I want you to pump so hard. Ignore the music. Try and beat it. So much sweat. So much magnificence. You're nearly there. Arms are flexed. We feel like an Olympic sprinter. Don't stop. Keep it going. You've got four, three, two, and hold. March it out. Okay, last cardio. Then we're going to move into our toning section. So you come over into your log jump or not log jump, log step. Up to you. Let's go. Over. So if you just pretend there's a giant log there, you're stepping over. If you want to jump, over. Keep going, last bit. Keep going, gang. Four seconds. Three, four, three, two, one. Yes. Well done. Bring over your friendly weight from where you safely stored it earlier. And we're going to move into some movements. You don't need a weight if you don't want one. Okay. We're going to hold the weight in front of our body like we're giving it a cuddle and we're going to squat. I'm going to turn to the side so I'm not crotch the camera. And we're going to take it down. So ground into the floor, break from the hip first, push your hips back, squeeze your glutes. So without the weight, you're just coming down and up. So you choose. Hips move back, knees move forward. Let's do it again. If you want the weight, you absolutely can. You can even hold it low if that felt better for you. Or on your chest. Oh, let's do it again. Last little bit. Squeeze the bum. Push into the floor. Last one here. Well done. So we're going to come down. We're going to bring it up and press it. All on one side. Exhale. So we pull it up, we catch it and press it. You can do the same movement with a dumbbell. As we press, our elbows very slightly in front of the body line. Get ready to change arms. Let's change the other side. Squatting right in the middle. Yes. Nearly there, last little bit of this one. Woo. 
Okay, we're moving into calf raises. Grab your plate, your dumbbell. You're gonna bring the feet underneath the hips. We're gonna push up and down, nice and carefully. Squeeze those calves. So, we're trying not to rock back onto the heel. Keep it loaded, woo! And a bit drunk. And lower. Last one for me. Well done. Hit the deck. We're coming down onto our mat or onto the carpet. You're going to put the plate or dumbbell on your pelvis. We're going to thrust up and down. Let's do it again. So if you're a guy, guys never want to do this exercise, but you really, really should. You really should. It's so good to support your lower back to have strong glutes and lots of people can't activate their glutes properly in a squat, which is where they get back ache. So this is a great exercise to start activating. Drive into the heel, squeeze the bum, pivot from the sternum, and kind of tuck your pelvis under a tiny little bit, a bit like a flasher. Let's do it two more times. Last one. And then we're coming into an ab crunch with or without the weight. We push up a tiny bit and lower. So, shortening, we close the top of our abdominals first. Okay, keep going. So you shut the top two abdominals and then curl your body off the floor. So close the top two and curl your body off the floor. Okay, let's do four more here. Keep it going, gang, with or without the play. A couple more for me. Well done, and bring it in. Smashing it, right, we are doing one more round. Just of that end bit. So, you've got a tiny little rest to get back up. Have no fear, we're only going from the squat. Grab your plate and join me. We're coming down and up. Let's go again. You keep going. I want to talk to you about the technique. So we're going to push our knees out and our bum back and push away, pulling down with our shoulders. So we don't want to be like this. We want to have space between our ears and our neck. Coming into that squat, keeping everything tight like a tiger. Pushing in, squeezing the cheeks. You're gonna do about five more, let's go. Down we go, push and squeeze. Three-ish, three more for me. Two, and one. Let's get ready, let's go the right arm first, down. And down. So keeping your elbow right in front of the body line, so. Cuts here, and then presses right there, see? So we're not open, feeling too much of a stretch. Come straight up. Last one, and change hands. So do it at your own pace, and just keep squeezing, dropping that shoulder down. Yes! Let's do it again. It's a nice one next, it's the calf raises. Two more press. Well done. Grab your plate, push up. Squeeze and lower. Let's stay here. Raise it up. Are you glowing? Glowing all over the carpet. Two more. Oh, I nearly fell over, but I did fall over. Last one. Well done. Coming down into your matted, carpeted, soft region. Bringing that dumbbell plate, can of beans onto your pelvis. I'm mildly tickled that you could have cans of beans on your pelvis. That makes me really happy. If you do, send me a picture. Squeeze. So I want you to concentrate, pushing into the heel 
and squeeze in your beautiful butt cheeks. Tucking that pelvis slightly under, so it comes up this way. Pivot from here. Okay, we're gonna do four more. Lift and squeeze. Can you do two more? Yes, Anna, we can. Okay, your ab crunches. Grab your plate, your option is to come up into a full sit-up. But we're not swinging this way. I want you to keep it pinned in, pin your back down, and just use, you, just use your abdominals. Okay, you've got four more for me. Keep going. I'm just going to remind you of technique. I want you to shut the front door first here. We go shut and then we curl up. Last one. Oh, well done. Well done. Give yourselves a clap. I would love for you to take yourself through a really, really, really nice stretch now. You deserve it. That was intense. Thank you so much for joining me. Check out the other videos on the channel and keep active, keep sweaty. It makes us all feel good. It's good for our mental health and that's what we all need at the moment. Uh, so a massive, massive well done at CC.